Hello curls, it's Yolanda Renee, and if you want to see how I put this wig on, definitely stay tuned to the rest of this video. Before we move forward, I do want to say subscribe to my channel. I have a lot of new content coming up, um, so yeah, let's get started. Alright, so first of all, of course you guys know I am team natural all day, every day, except when I have my wig on, <laughs> and since it's winter time, I definitely will be wearing a lot of wigs okay so I hope you guys are ready for some wig content um, but I definitely want to continue to promote healthy hair underneath of the um, wigs so um, today I did well last night I moisturized my hair with my L organics I use their leave-in conditioner well of course I put water on my hair and then I put leave-in um, this is their leave-in conditioner as well as their mint almond oil and I also used the cream it was from Oyen handmade and I don't have it up here but it's a, a daily hair milk and it's amazing I'll probably have to go get it because I know you guys want to see it let me go get it okay I'll be right back so yeah this is the Oyen handmade hair do and it is a daily hair quenching lotion and it is amazing. This works amazing on my daughter Skylar's hair, who you guys know is 4C, 4B, 4C mixture. And it works good on Taylor too. So it definitely works for all hair types. You have to get this. So um, thanks to First and Last PR, who who keeps me stocked with Oyen Handmade. So thank you, um, Stephanie. How I twist, um, braid my hair, and I'll show you clips here and there, but how I um, twist my hair, because I do chunky twists. So I came up with the idea of cutting a little square um, from right here, so it would allow me to have a center part and a side part. And I basically have three twists, but I really love this technique because again, I can have two different types of parts. Edges, let's talk edges. Before I put my wig on, I do make sure my edges are nice and, you know, slick laid as people say <laughs> but um cream of nature actually recently sent me this little travel kit and it is so cute don't have the packaging because i knew i wanted to show you guys but it's definitely all gone <laughs> but this is their new on the go um edge control isn't it adorable it's um a smaller container of their perfect edges and it is it looks like a little chapstick thing so this definitely is helpful on the go and it comes out I mean it's a little it's a big opening so I was thinking that I can refill this I was you guys know I'm gonna get creative but seriously I'm thinking about refilling this because I have um where is it okay, it's in my little to-go pouch I have the full size of this on to go so I was thinking if I use some type of craft like squeezy thing I could you know put this in there and squeeze it back in there I don't know I'm just trying to save some money and have y'all save some money too um, but these I think this is the most adorable thing ever so I use that for my edges and um, cream of nature also sent me this edge control brush you guys when I got this package and I was like so excited about it I posted it on my snapchat and on my Instagram y'all I was promoting this brush forget the on-the-go product I was like this I needed this cuz I always use a toothbrush so I was so happy when I saw this but the real product is the on-the-go Um, but anyway, so once my edges are slicked down, I put my wig on. And my twist acts as an anchor. The straight wigs I have they do not have combs already in them um, but I have been using bobby pins to secure them down on the perimeter of my hair and I feel like bobby pins are less damaging than the combs that's just my personal preference and it's what I had to do because I didn't want to sew in combs because I really do think combs can be a bit damaging
I'm just gonna use this um, liner to camouflage. You see how you can see the silver a little bit right here? I'm just gonna put some black on there so it's camouflage. Anyway, so once I had my wig on, I also used this cute little brush um, from Kiss. Bring the Salon Home Kiss. I like it. It makes my hair really, well, it makes the wig fluffy. It's 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 like a wig brush to me. Um, so that's what I use on here. And I also curled my hair today with my, um, what was that from? Eva NYC Flat Iron. Okay, so I know everybody has seen this trick before, but I'm going to be using this NYX palette to, like, you know, make that part... how I curled this hair let me know what you guys think of these wild curls I did the curls like all different directions to give it like some character <laughs> anyway I hope that I gave you guys some great tips I um, was getting ready to do my other video and um, I was getting ready so I was like I might as well film me putting my wig on so this was so random um, but anyway thank you guys so much for watching for real goodbye <laughs>